Okay, so Emily decided to wake up at 10 a.m. today for no reason. I woke up at 5 a.m. We are going to breakfast, however, it's like 11. We're in a really shady part of town and I'm really scared. It's actually so It's so scary. Is that Rihanna? That is Rihanna. I mean, it's not a real Rihanna, it's a picture of Rihanna. We're in this like weird area full of like people that I just cannot relate to and <laughs> I'm like freaking out. Like Emily was like, let's walk. 25 minutes to this cute little like five-star breakfast eatery that's still open and I'm just like okay and then she was like we have to go through a shady ass neighborhood to get there I know that this is a really pretty building though I would live in it honestly let's walk here there's no traffic laws so you just like walk whenever you feel like it it's like really entertaining However, I'm like, feel like we're gonna get robbed. Like there's Victoria's hair, Kelly's weave, Les Petite's hair, Coco Butte. It's just shady. I feel like we're in the south side. I feel scared. If we die, this is the last you'll ever see of us. So, hope you love us. I'm so scared. This is not my favorite one. I love me too. Okay, bye guys. We've made it through the shady area to this restaurant and there's a line outside and I'm not very happy about that. Everything that we want to go to, there's a line at. Like Louis Vuitton yesterday, we walked so far and worked so hard to get to, and there was a line. Very, and very frustrating. It's called Holy Belly, Holy Belly 5. I'm just not vibing with all these lines. Not at all. My leg hurts like so bad, like this leg, I don't know why, but like right here, Hurts really bad, and I don't know why. So it's like fun. So this restaurant, I guess, was all with the way they like brought us in before everyone else, because apparently like two people is better than four. So they had a table for two available, and it's actually really cute. There's like these like grass. It looks like we're in a greenhouse. And then I don't know what I'm gonna order yet. I might show you like a sneak peek of what I'm gonna order. This is the sparkling lime lemonade that I ordered, and I'm really excited to try it. I'll let you guys know what I think. I've already tried it. Emily has tried it. She thinks I like it, but I don't like sparkling, so like I'll find out. We'll do a taste test together. I actually really like it. I don't mind the sparkling, surprisingly. So the eggs and the butter and the bacon and the bread look amazing. Like this literally looks fucking amazing. And even with the little flour to like, ugh, the mood. Holy shit. So I just took a bite into my eggs and these are the best eggs I've ever had in my entire life. This painting is 110 euros and I really want it so I might get it. Hello everyone, we're on our way to the Louvre. We're going to take photos and I've got this beautiful Parisian shirt that Matthew bought me. We're going to take photos. I brought my jewel. I snuck it into the country. I already <laughs> told you that though. Emily, how are you doing? I dressed Emily in this beautiful outfit that I made her wear and I literally love it. Look at her plaid, like tweed skirt with her black bodysuit and black sling back heels. Not from Dior, however, I wish they were. So we're going to the Louvre. I'm very excited to go and take photos and look at the Mona Lisa, which I've already seen. It's quite small. It's about the size of the Chanel bag. Is it really? Oh yes, darling, it's very small. So we're going to the Louvre. We're going to look at the Mona Lisa and the statue. Oh my God, guess what I just realized. What? <sighs> The entire apeshit video by the darling woman, Beyonce, and her <laughs> husband, Jay-Z, was created inside of the Louvre. Really? They closed down the Louvre to create the song Ape Shit. <laughs> so we're going to go to all of the places where Ape Shit was created, yep. and we're going to do a photo shoot in all of them. I love it. We're All of that. So We're going to take many photos. I'm bringing my giant camera because uh, one must always have a giant camera or else you're poor. So <laughs> we're going and we're very excited. I I'm like wearing my Louis Vuitton scarf that I bought in Paris, my Burberry trench coat that I bought in New York City, my white 
no, I'm not wearing white. My black Hermit Lang skinny jeans and my Balenciaga underwear and my Balenciaga shoes as well as my regular white socks. I do not know where I bought them. No, that's not a Chipotle. It is. Oh my god, there's a Chipotle. There is Starbucks. The Chipotle is not open yet. Look at that Chipotle. It's right there next to McDonald's. Okay, so we're going to the Louvre. I've said that 12 times now. <laughs> I will vlog once I get there. <laughs> Hong Kong, move the fuck out of the way. <laughs> yeah, yes, move out of the way. Go. Nobody wants you here. This is the Louvre. This is the giant building that is the Louvre. I'm so There tired. is the Louvre. Inside, there is a gold mechanism. I don't understand what it is. I don't actually know, but we are about to exit the vehicle. We made it inside of the Louvre. We're in the statue room. We're headed to Mona Lisa, so I can show Emily Mona Lisa. It'll be super cute. I'm excited. So I desperately want to take a picture laying on these stairs like Beyonce did in Ape Shit. But I'm having a feeling that that's going to be quite impossible with the amount of people on these stairs right now. When I came here in November, there was like no one here, so I need to do that again. But these are the iconic stairs where her and like 400 other people were laying and doing their little um, leg lifts and shit. I want to lay right here and like take a picture and I can't. We have made it to Miss Mona. Mona Lisa. Over there. There she is. Standing proud and beautiful inside of her little glass. It used to not be inside glass, but then someone tried to destroy it and now it's inside glass. So there you go. Look at her. Bye. We're finally at the Louvre. Apparently we're a cute couple. So this is still under construction, but my dream wedding is down there. Like I would love to get married down there. Like can you imagine? Like obviously if it's clean. Yeah, I've seen prayer. Like it used to be pretty, but like imagine getting married at the Louvre, like going down the stairs and like, uh, yes. Me too. Me, me too. Me fucking too. Yes. Same girl, same. So guys, I took an iconic picture in front of this bitch getting crowned because God knows I am a king. And then I saw this one and I was like, oh my god, this is so Emily. Like, let hold on, let me show you. So that's Emily as fuck right there. Literally Emily, that is Matt. Matt's ass is out, just about to stab Emily. And this bitch is like scared as fuck. That's like pixie. We are now in ancient Greece. And I told Emily that her heels would hurt her. And now she's telling me that she understands that her heels hurt her. So she's like in pain. And I'm like, I told you. I'm gonna try to find more paintings. And I guess we're continuing to go underground because that's where this is going. What? These were statues? I guess we're gonna go look in here. The lighting right here is really good. Oh my god. Emily, this lighting is amazing. Hello everyone, I'm beautiful. Take a picture. Guys, I found my life story. So that, that naked man is me, and that snake is some other people in my life. So, um, living. <gasps> look, it's Hermes. Hashtag Birkin who? Living for them little ankle foot things. I'm gonna need one of those. Hermes needs to start carrying that in their stores. And then, um, hi, I need that torch. Hello. So in this household, we don't walk. So we decided that we were just gonna take the elevator up the three flights of stairs. It's literally three steps and I'm literally living. Vamanos. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Made it to the area with the jewels. And let me just tell you, these are all the diamonds and the crown jewels of all of royalty and I'm living for the haul. These are the jewels. They're the sapphires, the diamonds, the rubies, the crystals of the royal family. That's the River Seine and then over there is Notre Dame. Go. That's my section. Left the Louvre, there's the exit. In case anyone didn't know, there's actually a mall underneath the Louvre. It's called the Printemps to Louvre and then there's the Apple Store. There's like stores down there, and then the exit is down there, but like the exit's also down there. So pretty much this is a mall, it's inside the Louvre, it's like cool and pretty and fun and nice and stuff. We finally made it outside the Louvre, it is behind me, and we are currently in this garden. Very pretty, someone's playing Hello by Adele on a piano and it sounds really pretty, but we're exhausted and hungry and we just walked the entire Louvre, like the entire thing, and it was not fun. I mean, it was nice, but it wasn't fun. So yeah, we're gonna go, <laughs> we're gonna go get food now. But the Eiffel Tower is behind us. It is so sunny, I cannot see anything. I'm literally closing my eyes. I liked yesterday's weather better, 
because it was like breezy and cold and not as sunny and I don't love this for me. Where did Emily go? Yeah, I just don't love this. We just these sunglasses, bonjour. And we stopped and got drinks and tea at this place. This place, it's fun. And then I wanna go over there to the Christian Dior. It looks cute. I don't know, we're gonna go to Louis Vuitton and Chanel after this. Emily is dying. Right, so we had to go back to the hotel at some point. It's really exciting. Love that. I look better without sunglasses. So that's because I look hot anyway without anything on. Um, I'm going to order and then get back to you guys in a second. We're going to Angelina, which is my grandma's favorite restaurant in Paris. And it's kind of disappointing and bittersweet because I don't talk to my grandma anymore. She doesn't like me. Um, so... I really have like no one to tell anymore that I'm going here, so it's kind of like disappointing, but I'm excited to try my grandma's favorite restaurant. Just kind of bittersweet moments for me, you know? Family problems, gotta love those. When I stayed at the Shanker Law in the penthouse, they gave us tons of little boxes of these like mini rose shares and this little box. They were amazing. This is the snacks. It literally looks spectacular. And then over there is the tea room. And over here is the restaurant and I'm very excited to try food here. This is the world famous hot chocolate. It's my grandma's favorite drink ever and I'm super excited to try it. I'm trying to decide what to order and I really don't know. This thing looks amazing, but so does this, and this, and everything else is not a picture, so I really don't know what to get. The hot chocolate looks amazing, and the whipped cream is homemade, and I'm literally freaking out. I love it. So we ordered a brunch, so it, obviously my hot chocolate came with it. These amazing croissants. By the way, I've had this jelly before. My grandma brought some back from Paris last time, and oh my god. Oh my god, this jelly is fantastic. She got a cocktail. I can't wait to try it. Oh my god, I'm just like, it's so good. The eggs Benedict just came, and this is my smoked salmon. She doesn't eat, so I can't wait to eat it. Oh my god. This, I'm getting, I am getting this shit to go. I am getting it. I ate all of it. Oh my fucking god. You like the eggs Benedict? Oh, you don't. I didn't try it. I'm weird about eggs. Yeah. It doesn't look that great. And after it exploded on you, I'm just... Did you hear that? What happened? It like erupted in like a weird noise. Yeah, it's really interesting. So we are now leaving Angelina Paris. We're very excited. I kept airdropping people photos and it was kind of hilarious. And then they airdropped me back photos and it was just hilarious. I bought some jellies. You know, we're headed to Louis Vuitton right now. I'm very excited. Very, very excited to go shopping, buy some things, get my little shopping fix on. It was just so funny. Me, me and Emily kept could not stop laughing because me and these random people kept air dropping photos to each other. And it was just so fucking hilarious. I literally loved it. Remember how I liked the one with the white yesterday? I really loved the one with the red. Like, I kind of not sure about it. So I'm trying on the all black and I really love them. I don't know which ones I like more though. So like comment down below and let me know. Love these, like even the soles are glittered. Oh my God. And the inside is blue, which is like my favorite part because I really love this color blue for some reason. This Louis Vuitton knows how to properly assist people. This lovely woman, very sweet, walked up and said, Bonjour, how are you? What would you like to get? We'll go get you a sales associate. And what would you like to drink? And we both said, Moe, please. And she said, okay, I'll go get it. Have a seat. We're ready for you. And I'm like, good. Unlike the other Louis Vuitton that required us to wait in line outside and was just so rude and I'm just so over it. This Louis Vuitton over in Vendome Plaza is so much cuter. Place de, place de Vendome, go to that Louis Vuitton, way nicer people, hello. Have to get our moe, very exciting. Hold it there, you will be good. And some lady thought we were talking to her. So she kept on looking at us and like, well, waving. It was so funny. We were like, we're not. We're like, we don't care about you. <laughs> we're sorry, you're cute and all, but like, we're not talking to you. Was she cute? No, <laughs> but I think she was. <laughs> That's good. I love this. So I asked for something that I ask for every single time I go to Louis Vuitton and every time they never have it. It's one of those call for availability items that is impossible to find on the website and they have one in all of Europe and it's sitting right over there. So of course I have to buy it. It'll finish the trifecta and I can't wait to unbox it for you guys but I'm not going to reveal it until later. Where is the wages? My followers are killing me, but I love it. 
How many euros? Oh my, it looks so good on you. You look so good. Show me. Show me front ways. Yes. It's like I did bring my vlogging camera in the bathroom, but Louis Vuitton bathrooms are always the prettiest freaking things ever. Like, hello. What the fuck? It's so pretty in this Louis Vuitton, like literally gorgeous. Oh my fucking god. That was the hand in the bathroom. I love those. Gotta go shopping. Just left Louis Vuitton, picked up some things, can't wait to do an unboxing. Headed to Chanel again, picked up some things this morning. Now I'm in Champagne. love with this bag. I like it better than the Gucci, the Balenciaga, and the Louis Vuitton. Literally obsessed. Oh my god, I want it. Went to Chanel, got some more champagne, getting some more card holders, and a bag. We left Chanel, and we're now in a car on the way back to the hotel. What? I coughed on accident. I want chocolate so bad. Oh my god, Angelina we, chocolate? Why didn't we get it? I don't know. We got jelly. Yeah. We got jelly, not chocolate. What was why wrong are we with so us? stupid? Anyway, we're headed back to the hotel from Chanel. I got this giant bag, this bag, and another bag. It's you got down three there. Bags. And well, four Louis Vuitton. Bags. Very exciting. I just dropped my phone. Anyway, we're going to the hotel. I will catch up with you guys when I get there. Yeah.